Hello viewers, today we are going to discuss about why negative feedback is mostly preferred in a closed loop system. So this is our closed loop system, G is known as gain and H is known as feedback, R of S is the reference input and C of S is the output. So here when you consider a negative feedback, the error signal is nothing but this is, na this is the difference between your reference input and the feedback signal. Right. So that is the error signal. So what about the value here? We are doing a subtraction. Therefore, the overall gain of the system gets reduced. Right. So whenever the gain of the system gets reduced, automatically you see it increases the stability of the system. So the stability of the system is more convenient in case of a negative feedback. And the second main advantage is it has low sensitivity to parameter variations. That is a slight change in a parameter won't affect the system. It will always remain stable. 